1. The Dark Water, The Elisa Lam Story In the early 2000s, a young woman named Elisa Lam decided to take a solo trip from Vancouver, Canada to California. She checked into the Cecil Hotel in downtown Los Angeles, a historic hotel with a dark and mysterious past. Elisa was an avid social media user, and throughout her journey, she regularly updated her blog and Tumblr account with her experiences. However, things took a disturbing turn when Elisa suddenly disappeared. She was supposed to check out of the hotel on January 31, 2013, but she never did. Concerned about her whereabouts, her family reported her missing to the police. The case gained significant attention when a surveillance video from the hotel's elevator was released to the public. The video showed Elisa acting strangely, pressing multiple buttons, and stepping in and out of the elevator in a seemingly erratic and frightened manner. Her behavior appeared as if she was talking to someone or something that wasn't visible in the footage. Days turned into weeks, and the search for Elisa intensified. Meanwhile, hotel guests began to complain about low water pressure and a peculiar taste in the tap water. Finally, on February 19, 2013, the hotel staff discovered a horrifying truth. Elisa's body was found in one of the water tanks on the hotel's rooftop. The tank was the source of the hotel's water supply, explaining the unusual water quality experienced by the guests. The circumstances surrounding Elisa's death were baffling and raised numerous questions. How did she end up in the water tank? Why was the roof accessible to guests? What caused her erratic behavior in the elevator? The autopsy report revealed no signs of physical trauma or drugs in her system, making her death even more perplexing. Speculation and conspiracy theories emerged, with some suggesting paranormal involvement or foul play. The Cecil Hotel's dark history, including its association with murders, suicides, and infamous guests like Richard Ramirez, the Night Stalker, added to the eerie atmosphere surrounding Elisa's case. Ultimately, the official cause of Elisa Lamb's death was ruled as an accidental drowning, with bipolar disorder being a significant contributing factor. It was suggested that her erratic behavior might have been a result of a manic episode. The story of Elisa Lam continues to captivate and disturb people to this day. It serves as a reminder of the inexplicable mysteries that can occur in our world, leaving us with more questions than answers. 2. The Black Dahlia, the unsolved murder that captivated the nation. In the annals of true crime, few cases have captured the public's imagination quite like the chilling and unsolved murder of Elizabeth Short, known as the Black Dahlia. The tragic events that unfolded in 1947 Los Angeles have since become an enduring mystery, leaving investigators and amateur sleuths alike searching for answers. Elizabeth Short, a 22-year-old aspiring actress, was last seen alive on January 9, 1947, at the iconic Biltmore Hotel in downtown Los Angeles. Short had dreams of Hollywood stardom, but her life would be cut tragically short. Six days later, her mutilated body was discovered in a vacant lot in Lemert Park. The murder of Elizabeth Short was particularly gruesome. Her body had been bisected at the waist, leaving a ghastly smile like cut across her face. The brutality of the crime sent shockwaves through the community and the media, earning her the moniker Black Dahlia due to her penchant for wearing black clothing and dark hair. The Black Dahlia case quickly became a media sensation, with newspapers competing to cover the lurid details of the murder. Reporters delved into Short's personal life, emphasizing her alleged relationships with men and casting her as a femme fatale. The intense media scrutiny added an air of mystique to the case, perpetuating its enduring allure. Over the years, a plethora of theories and suspects have emerged, but none have definitively solved the mystery of Short's murder. Suspects range from acquaintances and romantic interests to notorious criminals and even some with alleged connections to the police. The list includes Dr. George Hodel, a prominent physician, and the infamous gangster, Bugsy Siegel. The Black Dahlia case remains one of the most enduring mysteries in American history. It has inspired numerous books, films, and documentaries, cementing its status as a cultural phenomenon. The public's fascination with Elizabeth Short's tragic fate persists, with enthusiasts and armchair detectives tirelessly investigating and speculating to this day. The Black Dahlia investigation faced several hurdles, including a lack of forensic technology and a growing list of suspects. The case file spans thousands of pages, filled with interviews, tips, and dead ends. Despite the efforts of dedicated detectives and subsequent task forces, the truth behind the murder remains frustratingly elusive. Elizabeth Short's murder, known as the Black Dahlia case, continues to haunt the public imagination more than seven decades later. 
The mysterious circumstances surrounding her death, coupled with the graphic nature of the crime, have ensured its place in true crime lore. Until new evidence emerges or a confession is made, the Black Dahlia will remain an enigmatic figure, forever etched in the annals of unsolved mysteries. 3. The Girl in the Box, A Harrowing Tale of Captivity and Survival In 1986, the shocking case of Colleen Stan, known as the Girl in the Box, sent shockwaves through the nation. Colleen's horrifying ordeal began when she was abducted by Cameron and Janice Hooker and held captive for over seven years. During a portion of her captivity, she was imprisoned in a small box underneath the couple's bed in a hotel room in California. This gripping true story sheds light on the resilience of the human spirit in the face of unimaginable cruelty. In May 1977, 20-year-old Colleen Stan accepted a ride from Cameron Hooker, a seemingly friendly and ordinary-looking man. Little did she know that this encounter would mark the beginning of her years-long nightmare. Cameron, along with his wife Janice, had sinister intentions. They abducted Colleen at knife point, overpowering her and subjecting her to unimaginable horror. For the next seven years, Colleen endured a life of relentless abuse and manipulation. She was kept as a prisoner in a small, soundproof box hidden beneath the couple's bed. The box was so confining that Colleen was unable to sit up or fully stretch her limbs. The hookers used psychological tactics to control and manipulate her, including threats of violence against her family. Cameron instilled a profound sense of fear in Colleen by convincing her that he belonged to an underground organization known as The Company, which had eyes everywhere. He brainwashed her into believing that disobedience would result in the murder of her family and herself. This psychological control played a significant role in maintaining her captivity. Colleen occasionally experienced brief periods of relative freedom outside the box. However, she was constantly monitored and subjected to physical and psychological torture. The hookers isolated her from the outside world, limiting her social interactions and ensuring her complete dependency on them. In 1984, Cameron Hooker, overwhelmed by guilt, revealed Colleen's existence to his wife, Janice. This disclosure ultimately led to her liberation. Janice, recognizing the inhumane nature of their actions, helped Colleen escape in 1986 and contacted the authorities. In 1985, Cameron Hooker was arrested, and a lengthy legal battle ensued. His trial shed light on the shocking details of Colleen's captivity. Hooker was eventually convicted and sentenced to consecutive life terms, while Janice received a lesser sentence for her cooperation. Despite enduring years of unimaginable cruelty, Colleen Stan demonstrated remarkable strength and resilience. After her escape, she played a vital role in raising awareness about the plight of victims of long-term captivity and abuse. Her story serves as a testament to the human spirit's ability to endure, survive, and reclaim life after unimaginable trauma. The harrowing story of Colleen Stan, the girl in the box, serves as a chilling reminder of the depths of human depravity and the strength of the human spirit. Colleen's courage in sharing her story has helped shed light on the issue of long-term captivity and has inspired others to speak out against abuse. Her remarkable journey of survival continues to captivate and inspire people around the world.